the topic for this video is arithmetic pipeline now there are certain applications which require repeated arithmetic operations like addition subtraction multiplication and many more so we use arithmetic pipeline for such purposes basically to speed up processing because as you know pipelining has an advantage of speed up performance let's illustrate this with an example for example if you need to add or subtract to floating point numbers what are the steps that we follow though this problem can be solved in many ways there can be many steps to do so but in general we follow four steps that is first we compare the exponents second is we align the mantissas third we add or subtract them and fourth is we normalize the result let's illustrate this by taking two values we take two numbers one is x like 0.9504 into 10 raised to the power 3 and y is equal to 0.8200 into 10 raised to the power 2 if we need to add or subtract these two numbers what we will do is firstly we will compare the exponents that is 3 and 2 and this comparison is done using subtraction whatever the result will be after subtraction we will show which one is greater for example here the exponent 3 is greater therefore the result will also have the exponent 3 so we have compared it and because we have chosen the larger exponent we align the mantissas according to it therefore after alignment x will be 0.9504 into 10 raised to power 3 itself but y will become 0.0820 into 10 raised to power 3 now because the exponents are the same we will perform the operation that is add or subtract for example if we are adding the after adding the result we will get is 1.0324 into 10 raised to power 3 that is we have performed the addition or subtraction the last step is normalize the result that is what what is normalization normalization is basically done so as to have a fraction with the non-zero first digit right so after normalization shifting of the mantissa is done to the right and incrementing the exponent by 1 we will get z is equal to 0 0.103 to 4 into 10 raised to power 4 so this is your answer now this can be illustrated by this particular diagram this is an arithmetic pipeline where we have exponent and mantissas as you remember the intermediate results in a pipeline are stored in registers which is r now first we are comparing the exponents that will be done in the first segment meanwhile nothing is done to the mantissas so we have written nothing in the mantissa section of segment 1 after this when the comparison is done it is stored in the register and we align the mantissas according to that difference we are linking them meanwhile we choose the exponent right as we chose 3 here and we are aligning it that was done simultaneously in the segment 2 in segment 3 we need not do anything to the exponents but we add or subtract the mantissas and the result are stored in the registers then in the last in the fourth segment we adjust the exponent of the result and here we normalize the result and again the result are stored in the registers so this was an example illustrating the arithmetic pipeline and this is basically done to speed up processing thank you